In a later development, the Vice Chancellor of Nigerian Army University Bureau Bono State, Professor Kiari Mohammed, says the federal government needs to be proactive in dealing with insecurity, as Boko Haram bandits remain the major deadly groups in Nigeria. The Vice Chancellor also says the Nigerian government must stop using back channel dialogue where hefty ransom is paid but rather adopt a comprehensive national security architecture to end insecurity in the country. Professor Kieri Mohammed, while giving lectures during the 12th convocation at the Adamawa State University, urged the federal government to do everything possible to bring an end to the insecurity situations in the country before it will be too late for them to contain. In the short term, the best way of dialogue is to defeat Boko Haram if we can. Defeating Boko Haram means defeating the very strong sections and elements of the violent extremist group. And then you can now sit on the table with the decapitated and weakened group, you know, with a view to bring in peace. The Adamawa state governor congratulates the university and assured them of his government's readiness to fix all that was destroyed by Boko Haram. It is incumbent upon us to see this event not only as difficult but as a landmark in the annals of the university and the entire state. Most significantly, it represents a watershed in the lives of most of the graduates who have waited too long for this day. Adama State University occupies a place of pride in the heart of every patriotic citizen of Adama State. As an administration, my government is prouder of its growth and development over the years. On the part of the former governor, Dr. Boni Haruna, whom the university was established under his government, called on the state government to return the lost glory of the institution. He said the university should not be allowed to operate on the basis of sentiment. The vice chancellor at the Mawa State University, Professor Kaleta Pua Judge, said Boko Haram has caused a lot of damage on Nigerian universities, urging the government to beef up security in all the schools in Nigeria. I grew up in this town. When you look at the left hand side, was my sister's house when she was teaching here. She was a teacher here. I, I am part of parcel of this community. There is no justification for us to take decisions on major issues that can enhance our collective decisions, I mean development, and another government just looks at it as a known issue. The university has grown from strength to strength in terms of academic programs and other essential services in its two decades of existence. This is coupled with the fact that many academics have left the system during those old harrowing days and some have retired. Thus, a window on employment needs to be opened with an improved suspension from the government. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.